Hello and welcome to View from the Deck from Princess Yachts in partnership with Boat International. It's day three of the Cannes Yachting Festival and the show is in full swing. There are over 700 boats here this week, including 130 global debuts. Two of which come from Princess Yachts, the Y95 on which we are sitting right now and also the brand new Y80. Today we are talking about sustainability and responsible yachting and we've got three very qualified gentlemen here to answer a few questions. First up, Nick Smith from Princess Yachts, Ronnie Scowan from Sleipner Group and Raoul Tehaida from Whisper Power. Gents, welcome. Thank you. Thank you. So I understand your, your three companies have been collaborating on something quite special. I wonder if you could tell us a bit more about that. Yeah, we've got this, uh, we've got a really exciting silent hotel battery system which we developed for a for a specific customer's requirement. So it enables silent running of the boat. So we can have, uh, we've got, you don't have to run the generators, you can run your air conditioning, your stabilization, all of your high draw electrical items can be run off the battery overnight. Ronnie and Raoul have been helping us with providing the right kit and then getting it all working together. Yeah, no, we, we, we make very efficient stabilizers for that. And then we also have very efficient thrusters. We've gone to a much higher voltage than typical. It's a 48 volt system and a 24 volt system that's mostly on the boats to, to enable the system to be more efficient. Uh, Raoul does the charging and inverting and the batteries. We also do some charging on PPO generators that's made from to do high, high powers. We can charge the batteries really fast again. And the telematic, I think, is very important uh, to connect all the, all the hardware into one software communication funnel. So your, your stuff, our stuff connected, yeah. all monitored on the distance. And I think that's where, that's where the collaboration and cooperation comes in. Because one thing that sometimes, and I think is still a bit of a thing in boats today, all systems are looked at as individual. Yeah. Where I think- Disparate systems. Yeah, exactly. And if we can actually join together and look at that, could we use this for also this and this? If we collaborate, if we can save a lot of parts and products and weight in the boat, they are more sustainable, period. But is it true there's a sustainability premium? A lot of these systems cost more. But Nick, are you finding that customers are more prepared to pay a bit more for more efficient boats? Yes, because they, they get more. Yeah. I mean, the, some of the systems that have been developed, such as the overnight um, hotel battery, that actually provides a better boating experience. You can imagine dropping at anchor setting up for a lovely evening, beautiful sunset in silence without your generators running. What we're trying to achieve is not just making the boats more energy efficient, more ecological, more sustainable, but also to make a better boating experience. The customer wins. It's really exciting for us and, and something that we've got scope to expand and understand more as we build more of these systems. So I wonder if you would mind just casting your minds forward 10 years and the kind of boats Princess are going to be building with Sleipner <laughs> and Whisper Power Systems. Can you look into your crystal ball and tell us what that boat's going to look like and what the systems will look like. It's easy to say what will the boats look like in, in, in 10 years, but we've got real opportunities available to us right now with the technology around us to do things more efficiently, to try and look, are we optimising for weight? Are we optimising for energy efficiency? Could we, well, with the overnight battery system, we have a reduced air con loading. Um, so what are the other steps we can take to make the boats more efficient right now and step towards that future? Well, you've got to look at the package being very pragmatic and don't have unnecessary systems. Don't have extra this, extra that, extra that, but make safe systems that are collaborating and built so that you minimize any, anything that is weight and space. Behind the innovation is making boating better and reduce the carbon footprint. And we are at the stage of doing that. Well, gents, uh, lots of exciting developments. And I can't wait to see what each of your three companies come up with next. Thank you so much for joining us on View From The Deck. Enjoy your evenings. Thank, Thank you. Very much. Thank you very much. Don't forget to join us tomorrow when we will be talking about technology. You can watch every episode of View From The Deck on Princess's YouTube and social channels, as well as Boat International's social channels. I hope you're having a great show and uh, we'll see you tomorrow.